Hi everyone, my name is Nathan, and today we're going to be playing a little bit more Esper Tassigeist. Tassigergeist. I think one of my favorites is Geist of the Golden Bananas. The deck has a lot of potential names. We've made a couple of small changes to my version 1.25 video, and these really aren't like changes I'm going to make to say this is the actual version. They're just kind of more nods to the um, Magic Online meta. Normally I would do two Inquisitions and two Thoughtseize, but because there's so much burn, I made it three Inquisitions. It feels really bad to go like, you know, turn one Thoughtseize and see a handful of burn spells. The other change I made is I took the other Thoughtseize out of the sideboard and replaced it with the Timely Reinforcements. I just want to make sure that we can beat the burn decks. Um, that's really about it. Still sticking with Steel Shaper's Gift, I find that spell great. Uh, the Four Lingering Souls. Again, as I said in my last video, it could be that maybe the Fourth Lingering Souls could be another removal spell. It could even be that the 23rd Land could be a removal spell. It really just uh, depends on uh, you know the meta and, and what we experience with the deck. It's still very much in a refining phase. Uh, but that being said, I want to play some more with the deck. I wonder, it kind of feels like a revisiting for me. I, I've spent the last few days... Um, away from home so I didn't play any magic and I really didn't do much thinking about magic. Nice to have a bit of a break as much as I like this game but I'm going to try to get some games going for you guys. Uh, I'm going to try to enter an 8-man if I can. I don't normally do those primarily because their EV is pretty low. Um, if you, I, I would like to play more games and if you, you pay 6 tickets and if you lose the first game then you're out. It's a single elimination. So I, I guess you may sort of make your money back if you win. I think even if you win once, you win a pack of Fate Reforged, which means going for like three or four tickets and a pack of Cons, which is going for two, so you might make your money back. Uh, but anyway, um, yeah, I'll try to get some games going and see you guys in just a minute. Okay, there was a there was a two-man queue with somebody waiting in it, and the eight-man needed quite a number of people to... Um... My mom's calling me. I guess I better get this. Hold on one second, guys. Okay, well, I answer my mom's question um they're here visiting and it was dire that she know if i had pulled wanted pulled pork or salmon so uh, anyway i don't remember what i was saying oh there was like only a couple of people in the eight man queue so i opted for the two man so we are on the play and we're going to play uh this seems fine um we can even go turn one Steel Shaper's Gift here, which I think I wanted. Well, you know, I actually don't want to do that because I have no idea what I'm facing. So I'm just going to play this Flooded Strand with the intentions to get a Watery Grave. Oh, got to bring this guy down. I was, don't want to forget this. Let you guys keep up with the game. Okay, uh, play a land, pass turn. Feel like we're going to get Thought Caesar Inquisitioned. All right, probably going to take Geist. This makes me think it's either Junk or Black White Tokens. Guess we'll see. I'm sure he's looking at that Still Shaper's Gift like, hmm? But sometimes you see lots of, uh, you know, off-the-wall decks in two-man, so it's probably not that surprising to see something irregular. Opponent's taking inventory and taking time. I It's really going to be, it's either going to be Remand or Geist. He could also go for Snapcaster Mage. Um, okay, so it's Remand. Maybe he has another, either, I feel like when they don't take Geist, they usually have a plan that involves either, um, that involves either, uh, like, a Liliana or another disruption spell. So, I'm going to go ahead and play this planes, play the Steel Shaper's Gift, I'm going to get sort of light and shadow since I see white and black and pass. I just don't want to, like, I mean, continue holding it. I'd like to do something with my mana.
In the event that my opponent is running the Lianas and we get to keep this Lingering Souls, I'm going to play Lingering Souls next turn. I don't really see uh, a reason to to play Geist out just yet on an empty board. It's not like we have any removal spells to clear the way for him. Plus, you know, if we could play Lingering Souls instead of Geist and keep him from dying to Liliana, that would be great. Tarmogoyf, all right. Uh, yeah, I think we're just going to stick with the plan and play out our Lingering Souls. Uh, unfortunately, our opponent plays Skoo, so I, we're not going to get the other half of that. Okay, let's see. Um, I don't want to chump just yet. I don't think I need to. We can take a little bit of damage here. Okay, let's see. Um... I think now I do want to play Geist because I have, I can prevent him from getting sacked and I'll play a land. We have double black, white. I guess this could get a basic island or something. Um, do we want to attack? Uh, I guess maybe we want to attack with at least one and potentially one back to block. Because I think what we want to do next turn is put this sword on Geist. Let's see. Yeah, I will. Do I want to chump here? I'm just thinking if he has a way to get rid of one spirit token and then he plays a Liliana. Like, like it, it would be a, an efficient way. Yeah, I'm going to. I'm not going to block it all. Just in case, because I don't want to lose Geist, especially if I have a sword that I can put on him. Although the sword's probably going to get abrupt decayed. We are facing junk. Uh, most likely going to be Sword of Light and Shadow is my guess. Then again, if he, if he takes Snap, then that just means he has an abrupt decay. Okay, so he probably doesn't have the abrupt decay. Let's fetch. Um... I don't think it really matters. I do think we probably want more. Let this get a godless shrine. I don't even know if it matters. Um, so sadly, we cannot go. Let's play land. We can't go snap Steel Shaper's Gift because of these scoos. We are going to attack here. Uh, you know, actually, it may have been right to attack with another spirit token. Um, all right, we're going to pass. All right, eating the gift. So we have, we technically have our opponent dead. Like if he, let's see, six, seven, eight, nine. If we can chump with one spirit, like if he attacks with everything, we chump with a spirit token and then flash Snapcaster Mage and we're able to successfully attack with everything we could kill him. I, I think it's probably doubtful that we do that. Let's see how he chooses to attack here. Um, I don't really want to take four, but I kind of just want to... I'm, really, I'm actually really considering just throwing... 
Snapcaster Mage in front of Scavenge News. Um, let's think. That's four, five, six. Um, we're at eight. We want to be aware of Siege Rhino, so we don't want to go to three. I'm going to just use the Snapcaster Mage as a blocker because with the Scoos up anyway, it's not like... Let's see if he eats the Reman. He didn't actually eat the Reman, so Reman has flashback, which is great. So we're going to block. And if our opponent lets damage go through before eating the Reman, then we can cast the Reman. Okay, well, that was really good for us. Yeah, nothing to get. Okay, let's see here. Um, so we can't fetch because we don't want to go to three, although our opponent did not play a land. I'd still rather not go to three, though, if we can help it. What do we draw? Tassiger is good. Um, because of that, we're just going to... We're going to attack with... Yeah, we're going to attack with everything. Oh, we shouldn't have done that, actually. That was a mistake. Um, that was a mistake because he probably has a removal spell for Tassiger. And, well, there's a good chance he does. We should have left at least one token back. Maybe we'll get lucky. That was a mistake, though. Can we make the goif a little smaller? That would make the goif. Let's see. Instant sorcery creature. That would make him. That would make him smaller. Um, I'm gonna do that. Path to exile is the problem. Like that's how I'm. It's possible that I could have killed us by not leaving a spirit up to block. Yeah, so that's the issue. Um, we're not dead to that goif. But if he plays a fetch land, we are. And if he attacks, yeah, so we're dead. Uh, we'll concede there. That was I just got a little greedy with my attacks. Uh, unfortunately, I didn't realize it till the moment after I did it. Okay, so against Junk, we went Engineer Explosives. We went Murderous Cuts. Sower of Temptation. Um, a zealous Persecution. I don't think we went with an Owl Spell Bomb. Uh, I think we want to get rid of our Hand Disruption because we mainly just want to draw real spells. Um, Remands are just okay, but if we get a chance to to like play an early Tassiger and make good use of our remands, then I like them. I'm fine with the swords. Let's see, I guess we could cut two. I'd rather, ha I, I like the idea of leaving in the Thought Scours and potentially um, playing an early Tassiger and making our opponent have to deal with it. So we're gonna run this here. I believe this is correct. <clears throat> the other option I was considering is Set, kind of setting up for just a longer grind and pitching the two thought scours in favor of keeping the four remands. Like against this version of junk, against these versions of junk, remand isn't really awful. It it does hit lingering souls and it does hit. Uh... Man, if we had had a thought scour, that would have been sweet. Uh, well, we're gonna keep this. And flood strand's going to get a watery grave. Godless Shrine will help us hit our victim of the night, and we're good to go. Pass turn. Um... I think we're just going to play this tapped. Actually, 
maybe I should just play the island ran. What I should have done is play the island ran the snapcaster mage out there and yeah. Because what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to play this and pass. I could have ran snapcaster mage out there and then sort of had him as protection for Geist, M meaning an edict effect. I'm going to I'm going to run a snapcaster mage out there though for sure this turn at the end of this turn. Really? That seems odd to me. Does he want me to path it to give him a land? Is this the issue? I mean, I'm not going to just yet. I'll take three. Like, I'm, I'm taking three, but I'm, I'm going to gain a little bit more information, and it doesn't seem like I need to do that yet. And we'll just punch back with a Snapcaster Mage. Uh, and then we will play this and this. So now our opponent, if he does have a Liliana, he's going to be unable to both kill the Snapcaster Mage and Geist at the same time. Rhino or Lily? Oh, okay, so it's the Tassiger. Sure. Uh, well, we're going to fetch up a Plains, and we're going to go ahead and path now. One, six, 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 one, two, three, four. So we'd have to completely tap out to play Tassiger. That's probably okay, but let's see what we draw. Uh, Lingering Souls. Hmm. We're going to attack. Sure. Swamp or. We're gonna need a swamp in case there's a fulminator mage around. I'm just still trying to think of what the best play here is. I don't really want to sacrifice either of these, so I think I'm just gonna play a lingering souls to help protect against that. We'll pretend we have a path up. Um, and then I'm just going to actually no. what I'm going to do is I'm going to shock myself and I'm going to flash lingering souls back. Yeah, that's, that's better. I like this line. It still protects Geist from a Liliana and also represents a lot of damage on this swing here. I'm fine with Rhino because we're going to snap path it and punch for a lot. Um, let's go snap. Path to exile. This guy. Really surprised. Oh, I guess he kept an abrupt decays against us because of uh, the swords. 
opponent's not looking in good shape, and he's about to look in even worse shape. <clears throat> so we're going to... Oh, no, oh, he just quit. All right, so game three. Uh, Thought Scour or... I want to know what do you guys think. Do we want two Thought Scours or do we want the Romance back? Oh. I like the idea of playing a really early task here, given the chance, because our opponent doesn't run that many Path to Exile. So I'm just going to keep with this plan. Um, I would consider keeping this if it had a Serum Visions, but there's a really good chance we just do nothing, so we're going to mulligan. Uh, this hand's this hand's really not great either, but I don't want to mull. I really do not like mulliganing against junk. All right. Uh, Polluted Delta pass. That's going to get a... This will get like... This can get like a hollowed fountain or a watery grave. I could just go for basics here too. Okay, there's a goif. Um, I'm going to get a hollowed fountain here just so I can get a white source online if I want it. Geist. Um... And then I'm going to play this to fuel the yard. The fact that we have this and all of these is good. So if we can build some kind of a plan around that, I would really like to. Opponent's really aggressive with his treetops. Um... Hmm. I'm considering pathing the treetop village and then next turn I can play explosives to kill the goif but I, I think I probably want to save explosives for um, let's see if we path here Fetch. That's one, two, three. Let's see. That's one, two, three mana if we delve it all the way. Four, five, six. So we could play Tassiger next turn. Um, question is, what do we want to kill? Or we just don't kill anything, but then we can't play Tassiger. Um, I don't really want to walk Geist into a Liliana either. And I really don't want to use a path on a treetop if I don't have to. But, I mean, we don't have a lot of... We just think we have Ghost Quarters in the deck. I am not sure what the right line here is. Um... I like bolting these things, but we're not running red now. I think I'm just going to, for the time being, just take the damage because I want to see what I draw. Okay, so Victim of the Night's interesting. I'm going to pass back and probably Victim is treetop if he does this again.
Like, as long as this goes small, like, I don't really want to kill it. I just don't care that much. All right. I think I'm in a victim here. I don't really agree with our what our opponent's doing there, but maybe he knows something we don't. Um, let's see. One, two, three things. Four things is four mana. That would make five, six. Um, I'll take the two. I mean, I don't really want to give our opponent a land. He seems to be struggling in that department. Well, I don't know, because it's only his first main phase. So maybe he's not, but we'll, we will see shortly. Did I say earlier that I could kill the... I could kill the Goy for the Engineered Explosives, but not with the mana I have up. Not in one turn, anyway. All right, take another two. Um, all right, I'm gonna cast the Serum Visions. Another Tasker and another Path. I don't think I want the other Tasker, but I have enough feeling this other Path will come in handy. Um. I'm going to pass, and then I will go ahead and not be afraid to path this Goyf, knowing that I have another path available that will also let me play Tassiger for one. You know, it might have been right to just play Tassiger. Well, I guess we couldn't have played it earlier. Because playing Tassiger at this point will make a Goyf a lot smaller. All right. You have a Tassiger. We are going to have a Tassiger. Uh, let's see. One, two, three, four, five. So we can play Tassiger for this. Serum visions for this. Vi 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 serum visions with this and path with this. Um, is there anything we don't want to get rid of? Maybe we want to keep the other path to exile. Let's see if we go one, two. If we actually, so if we go serum visions again, then we go that. Let's we can do serum visions. Serum visions. Yeah, I'm fine with that. So what we're going to do is we're going to go Serum Visions. Ooh, Zealous Persecution could be really useful. We're going to put this in the bottom, put this on top, and then we're going to play Tassiger, and we're going to exile Serum Visions, Serum Visions, two lands, uh, and keep, keep the path just because it's more mana efficient. And then we're going to pass the turn. I guess we could have path before he could activate. Feels like a, uh, let's see. Okay, sure. So we have a zealous persecution on top, I believe. Okay. Mm so we're going to path here. Let's 
then I think we just want to make that coif really small. Um, I mean, we could just play Geist, and you can't make us kill it. And then we still have a potential way to kill Tassiger. Um, he's got one card, and he, he could plus us then, plus it then. Um, yeah, I kind of like trying to make his... He can't make a sack. He can plus. We'll get rid of the reman. And his goyf does nothing right now. But he's going to make us discard. So the goyf will get a little bigger, but not bigger than Tassiger. Discard that. Let's see. Okay, so we're going to take two. We're going to use this to kill the Goyf. Then we're going to punch Lily. We're going to attack, and we know we have Zealous Persecution. Opponent blocks. Uh, white, black. We win that fight, play out our Geist, pass the turn back. Um, we will attack with these guys. What a great team those guys are. Look at them go. Path to exile. Okay, well let's activate first. Blue, blue, uh, this, this. I guess he doesn't want to give us any of that. <laughs> Sower, okay. We will use the ability. We will get, see, we already have a, I guess we'll get a, I don't think it really matters. We will get a planes. Actually, I should have gotten a swamp and this could have gotten a, potentially gotten a planes. Uh, well, let's visions first because we like to see what's going to happen here. Um, so I think I kind of want to get a kind of maroons just because that gives us a chance to get back an engineered explosives. Um, oh, and we have another Tassiger. Cool. So I'm going to do it like... There's nothing like... Rem I don't want Reman right now because there's nothing he can actually... Like, anything that we remand, you can just play again. So let's do just attack. Put our opponent at three. Um, and then we will get rid of visions, polluted delta, remand, and play a Tassiger.
cool. Um, so it looks like one of these modern eight mans recently fired. Oh, just like one minute ago, we barely missed it. So we'll probably jump in another two man. <clears throat> um, anything we want to change? I think I'm fine with the way things are still. Cool. Well, I will uh, see you guys in another game soon.